Hi. Um, it's day 14 of quarantine. So, it's been a while. <laughs> Doesn't seem like a long time, but... Feels like a long time. I wouldn't necessarily mind being alone. If I could talk to my family more, if I was in a country I was actually familiar with, but... It just feels like I'm trapped. And it's not like I can even open a window and scream across the balcony to anyone, you know? It's a, I can't speak their language. I just don't understand. It was supposed to be this quick two-week little trip. In and out, take some pictures interview some civilians, send it off to the magazine, but now I'm here. Within a week I was stuck in this hotel room with nowhere to go because even if I go outside I'm gonna get charged with murder, so... I don't blame them for that though. People weren't taking it seriously and now people are dying by truckloads. I'm just hoping I don't get sick. Just hoping I can leave soon. It's just scary because people are getting infected so quickly. And then I can barely even talk to my family about it. Because by the time I'm going to sleep, they're waking up or vice versa, you know. And thankfully, they realize how serious all of these things are, but a lot of people back home don't. They still think it's a joke. But it's not. I don't know. I just... I hope if something bad does happen that I get to say bye to them. I get to see anybody. <laughs> but I'll just keep doing these videos, keep writing, just do what I can to keep afloat, you know, keep my spirits high and my door locked. <laughs> Wait, I, I think I hear. Singing. I'm gonna go check it out.